Groch's theorem. A crystal is made of atoms arranged in a periodic lattice, meaning the potential energy V of X that electrons feel repeats regularly. V of X plus A equals V of X, where A is the lattice spacing, or more generally, a lattice vector in 3D. The question is, what do the wave functions of electrons look like in such a periodic potential? Bloch's theorem states that in a periodic potential, the wave function of an electron can always be written as the product of a plane wave and a function with the same periodicity as the lattice. So the full wave function is this. Boundary functions. In mathematics, a boundary function refers to a function that is defined on the boundary of some domain, and it's used to determine or constrain functions inside the domain. Before Ted Kaczynski, well, you know, let's not talk about that. His papers included work on boundary functions of conformal mappings, which are ways of mapping one region of the complex plane to another while preserving angles and studying how the function behaves at edges of the domain or the boundary. 